Tom, uh, a night for resilience by our team and uh, a good point in the end. Yeah, we knew uh, Newport was a tough place to come. Uh, we knew we'd have to be defensively strong today and, and as a team we'd have to defend them quite well. Um, I think we, we did that, we did that in large spells of the game. Uh, disappointing not to, to take all three points in the end. Um, but we'll move on to Saturday and we can take plenty of positives from that game. Yeah, in the second half we had some decent positions on the counter attack. Maybe if we've just been a little bit more clinical, about taking a better option, we might have got something to do. Yeah, there you can say that. Um, we had a few chances. We, we, the lads on the top there, they're creating chances. So, uh, yeah, I'm sure we, we're going through spells at the minute. We've, we've been one of the, the highest scorers in the league. So, I'm sure we'll pick that back up real soon. For you tonight, captain, for the first time, that's been quite an honour, isn't it? Yeah, absolute honour, yeah. Um, delighted to be able to step in and, and, and lead from the front. Um, yeah, whenever you get the honour, it's complete honour. Last five minutes tonight, a lot of um, boys were putting it in the way, and then in our six-yard box, real, you know, real solidity and grit, just to make sure we hold on to that point. Yeah, I mean, um, we've, we've looked at like, a few stats uh, from the last couple of games, and we have conceded a... a more amount of goals than we'd want to, but um, yeah, I think we just got back to that. Yeah, say solidity tonight, and uh, hopefully we can take that into Saturday against Swindon and another good side. Um, just going forward, needs to keep building and, and take positives from each game. And your partnership with uh, Jordan seems to be getting better and better. Obviously, you'd hope would happen the more games you play, but you seem to dovetail pretty well. Yeah, uh, he's a great lad. Uh, we get on quite well off the pitch as well, so it helps. Uh, I think we've shared a good partnership. Um, Got Joe Mack coming back from injury as well, and Jamie Sandals White, who, who come in for Plymouth and Mansfield. Who, they're uh, pushing, pushing strong behind the scenes, so that keeps us on our toes as well. Last question: How important was the preparation for this game? It's been away, not having to travel back from Bradford on Saturday, then getting the coach again. Lots of long journeys. Having a couple of days off at Kings of Hurst, the gorgeous part of the facilities are really good, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, oh, I'd like to thank the board uh, and, and the people who on the financial side of the club for, for giving us that support and, and backing to be able to stay up St George's Park for that two, two nights and, and we've been away and had four nights together so they've given us the best, best opportunity to go away and, and get up max, maximum points out of the two games. Unfortunately we've only got the one but it's still another point to add to the ball. Back home now, a couple of big games coming up Saturday, obviously, and then next Tuesday, but can't forget to focus on Carabao Cup. You've got to get three points against Swindon. No, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, Colchester will be well at the back of our heads. Uh, tough game Saturday in Swindon. Uh, and yeah, as you say, we'll, we'll be back on the training pitch Thursday and Friday, working hard as we always do and, and, and prepping for that game on Saturday.